drop a like on this video in the next five seconds or else you will lose all of your fortnite skins and turn back into a default if you still need a season 2 battle pass or any of the awesome skins coming into the fortnite item shop do not worry here on the channel, I like to hook up a few lucky subscribers every single day with some of the brand new skins coming into the Fortnite item shop. So if you want to get gifted a skin from me, all you have to do is simply drop a like on this video, make sure you are subscribed to the channel, and also leave your epic usernames down in the comment section below so I can add you as a friend and send you your gift. And of course, massive shout out to all of you guys using my supporter creator code NERPA in the item shop. I appreciate you guys so much. And just as a little heads up, I am going to be doing a massive v buck giveaway today over on my live stream at caffeine.tv slash nerpa there's a link down in the description we're going to be live for six hours so i hope to see some of you guys over there in the chat what's going on friends and welcome back to a brand new fortnite battle royale video here onto the channel today's video we have some breaking information that was recently just found in the fortnite battle royale files after the last 12.1 update went live in fortnite talking about and covering actually revealing breaking information for a brand new vehicle that is going to be coming up in this next downtime update which is very very soon and it's actually going to be helicopters coming into the game as you guys know at the beginning of chapter two season one we actually had a brand new vehicle implemented into the game which obviously was boats and water played a very massive role once the brand new season of fortnite actually came out so it all made sense now here in season two i feel like they are keeping the momentum up with how many vehicles weapons and a lot of awesome brand new features that they are adding into the game because we have 100 confirmation in multiple different ways of proof that helicopters are going to be coming into the game which we are going to be looking at in today's video and we pretty much have all the information on how these helicopters are going to work so if you're curious or want to see what they look like in game make sure you're sticking around to the very end you definitely do not want to miss this video so after the 12.1 update went live last week this is when the initial files were found in the battle royale coding giving us proof that they are going to be adding helicopters when the next downtime update comes out which is actually going to be the 12.20 update in fortnite's battle royale now even before we found information in the files it was pretty Pretty much 100% confirmed that we were going to be seeing helicopters of some sort added into the game throughout the duration of season 2 for the simple fact that the reveal trailer for chapter 2 season 2 actually showed helicopters flying over the agency which is one of the brand new points of interest in the game now if that's not enough proof if you actually go to any of the brand new points of interest that were added once chapter 2 season 2 was released in fortnite you would actually notice that every single brand new poi actually has a helicopter landing pad which pretty much confirms and foreshadowed that helicopters were going to be coming literally since day one and if you guys don't believe me just land at any of the brand new points of interest and you can check these out for yourselves now when word spread around in the fortnite community that helicopters were going to be added into the game sometime during this brand new season a lot of people were extremely worried and a lot of people were already saying that they were going to be overpowered even though we don't actually have gameplay and have not gotten to use them for ourselves yet mainly because if you were playing Fortnite back in chapter one season seven you would pretty much know that during that season during that season the first ever vehicle that was able to fly around was implemented into the game which was obviously planes now like i said if you were playing Fortnite during this time you would know that when planes were added into the game it was probably the most hated update and change they have ever made in Fortnite's history up until that point the planes were extremely overpowered they spawned every Everywhere on the map they were able to shoot boost destroy builds you, you were able to hit players directly and do damage and launch them off mountains and kill them and overall they were very very overpowered and broken and everyone in the community hated them and it pretty much ruined season 7 for a lot of the people in the community so of course now that there is 100% confirmation in all of this leaks and information coming out that helicopters are going to be coming into the game a lot of us that experience planes during season 7 kind of have this little fear in the back of our minds that another flying vehicle is going to be overpowered but luckily since we were able to find all this information in the files we actually have all of the stats on what this helicopter is actually going to be able to do in terms of missiles how many people it holds the speeds the abilities how much damage it has and everything you want to know on this so make sure you guys are still watching because we are about to dive into that right now so fnbrhq over on twitter a very well-known data miner actually tweeted out saying helicopters 
are found in the files. As of right now, the spawn rates are zero, and this is not 100% confirmed, but I'm guessing that every single brand new point of interest in season two that actually has a helicopter pad is going to be where these things are spawning. So it's not going to be similar to season seven, where the planes were literally all over the map. There might be maybe three to four different locations where helicopters spawn, so they're going to be a little bit hard to get a hold of, and they're not going to be tons of them around the map to where Fortnite literally just turns into a helicopter battle simulator. Now the helicopters are going to be able to do 50 damage to the players and it's also going to do 150 damage to build structures if you actually directly run into them which is actually pretty effective. Now on top of that the helicopters are going to have explosive damage which does confirm that we are going to be shooting some sort of missiles or projectiles from the helicopter whether or not the actual pilot is able to control this or the other people on the vehicle it's not confirmed yet but it will do 70 damage to players directly with the explosive damage which I think sounds pretty balanced doesn't sound overpowered at all and then explosion damage to build is actually 450 so this is where the helicopter is really going to shine if there's a big build battle or a lot of players are boxing up shooting these missiles and doing 450 damage is going to be able to wreak havoc and actually clear a lot of those builds and walls to get to those other players now if you are able to directly run into a player going max speed you do 20 damage and then also whenever the helicopter blades actually hit someone when touched it actually does 100 damage which I think is insane if they don't have shields and the blades hit them it's pretty much an instant kill which I think is pretty funny now at the moment that was all the information that was actually data mined and found in the battle royale files in terms of the statistics and what this helicopter is actually going to be able to do the one thing that I know a lot of people are also curious about is how many players or teammates is the helicopter going to be able to hold now since Fortnite is a game that has solos duos and squads and looking back at previous vehicles almost every single vehicle that was released into the game if we look at the ATKs the planes obviously were another flying vehicle and most recently the boats that were added in the beginning of chapter 2 season 1 all of the vehicles are able to hold four players so if you are playing squads everyone on your team if they do want to will be able to actually get on that vehicle so I'm assuming it's going to be very similar with the helicopter there's going to be a pilot someone in the co-pilot and then since these sides of the helicopter are open there's going to be two players that are actually able to shoot at other people while the helicopter is flown by a pilot similar to what they've done with the ATKs and the boats like I mentioned previously and like we mentioned earlier in the video the release date for this is not 100% confirmed but we do know that when the 12.20 update comes out that is when this is going to be implemented that is when that is when the helicopters are going to be added into the files based on the information that we got after the last 12.1 update went live in Fortnite last week. And considering that the last downtime update we had actually came out on a Tuesday night, it's pretty safe to say that every two weeks, depending on if Fortnite actually follows their same schedule for updates, that next Tuesday, whenever we get the next downtime update coming out into Fortnite, which like I said, is going to be the 12.20 update, that is when we are going to be seeing the helicopter. So obviously, it's not 100% confirmed, but if we look at the patterns that they do with these updates it's pretty easy to look ahead and see exactly when this is going to be coming out either next Tuesday or Thursday depending on whatever day they do the downtime and of course a lot of the big updates are at 4 a.m. Eastern so that morning is when the helicopters are going to be in the game and for all of us in the community to be able to hop on and actually experience these for ourselves and of course with the 12.20 update going into Fortnite it's not only going to be adding the helicopters we're also going to be seeing some minuscule map changes taking place and also after the 12.1 update went live there was a bunch of new weapons added into the files which are probably going to be added in the duration and throughout the rest of season 2 so with the 12.2 so with the 12.20 update, helicopters and a brand new weapon of some sort is going to be coming into the game, which is very, very exciting. I love that Epic Games is back on track with constant updates on a really, really solid schedule, giving us different map changes and keeping the game as fresh as possible. So what I want you guys to do is let me know your thoughts and feedback down in the comment section below. Of all of you guys watching this video, I want to know your guys' thoughts, opinions, and concerns on the brand new helicopter vehicle coming into the game do you guys think it's going to be overpowered are you excited let me know what you guys have to say i love reading your feedback down below and i also try to heart and reply to as many comments as i possibly can that's all i got for you guys in today's video i hope you guys did enjoy if you guys did 
Do not forget to drop a like. Subscribe to the channel if you're brand new. We're going to have a lot of daily videos coming out for the rest of this season. And make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. I'll see you guys in the next one. Take it easy, my friends.